Hey everybody, welcome to Lifestyle Today. I'm Justine Santanello. Can you believe that summer is already winding down and it's almost time for the kids to go back to school? That went so fast. Don't worry, we have all the top back to school must haves for you guys today and lots of expert tips so that you can sit back and really enjoy the last bits of the season. But before we jump into all that, I am so excited to welcome our first guest of the show. Her music really has a special place in my heart and brings a smile to my face. Grammy award-winning singer Ashanti is here to tell us all about her new children's book, what she's up to now, and all of the exciting projects she has coming up. Welcome to the show, Ashanti. Thank you. Thank you so much. So your book, My Name is a Story, I had a chance to read it and really related. You know, my name being Justine, people had issues with that, so I can't even imagine what it must have been like for you growing up in the classroom. Can you tell us a little bit more about the book and how the story was so personal to you? Um, I love the book. It just comes from such a sincere place. Um, I definitely have so many stories about just growing up with a different name, you know, and, you know, you would sit around in a circle and it was time for the teacher to get to your name or to my name. There would be a little bit of hesitance. You know, some of the kids would look like, well, why does your name sound like that? Or how, why do you have so many letters in your name? How come your name's not like Beth, (laughs) you know? Mm -hmm. So I just remembered that feeling and I wanted to put something out there to encourage kids and to uplift kids and to let them know that it's okay to have a unique name. It's okay to be a little bit different and be proud of that and embrace it, you know, and, and be very, very confident. Well, listen, we can tell that you are embracing it. I saw the note in the book for your future children, which I thought was so sweet, about them also having a special and unique name. I really appreciate the fact that you didn't want to stray away from what your mother did for you, right? Absolutely. And I think usually when you have a unique name, there's some meaning to it, you know? So when you think about whatever you want to name your child and you put that meaning to it, that child should feel like, hey, I want to make sure that you pronounce my name correctly because there's meaning behind this, you know? So I wanted to get that out there. You have done, I mean, so many things in your career. What made you want to write a children's book? Well, when I was younger, I actually used to work at a daycare center. And, um, you know, when the kids had recess and they were like running around and playing and stuff, when it was time to for story time and I would get the book out, I would just see how captivated the kids were and how engaged and how they were just like into the story. And I was like, wow, this is kind of powerful, you know, reading a story and what it does to a child. And I always said, I want to write a children's book when I get older, you know? So I think just the timing was perfect. You know, I'm at a place in my career where I'm trying other things and, you know, going outside of the box. So I think this was just like the perfect thing for me. So we also know that you have new music that's about to be released. What can we expect from the new music? Well, the single is called Falling For You. And I love it because it's not like a reach for me. It's not something that's, super, super different than my, you know, just my Ashanti vibe, but it still has a 2022 spin on it. You know, it's relatable, you know, it's lyrically, it's just there. We've all gone through it. I co-wrote it with Blue. Um, And I'm so excited. I've played, I've been playing a few snippets on my Instagram and my DJ has been playing it after a lot of my concerts and the reaction has been incredible. So I just can't wait for you guys to hear it. All right. Well, you know, from one Long Island girl, with a tough name to another. (laughs) Thank you so much for being with us. This has been so wonderful. Thank you. Thank you so much.